the story of evolution. Hello, my name is Eleanor Captain Bradley. Today we are going to dip in the past and tell you about the fathers of evolution. Welcome to the past. This is Lamarck, a French scientist in the 18th century. So sits organisms are trying to achieve perfection. And then this giraffe must have stretched its neck so much it became longer in order for it to reach the tree. Be because this tree is beneficial, it will be passed on through generations. Eh, wrong. Mark believed that organisms strive for perfection and their perfected traits would be passed on to its offspring, but his theory was false. After Lamarck's death, he people finally looked at his work. <laughs> now let's step further into the future, the late 1800s. Now let me show you Charles Robert Darwin, one of the most influential figures in human history. I especially like him because he's a Brit, just like me. <sighs> Tasty. Don was a naturist who also had a theory of evolution. After his travels, he wrote a book, but was uneasy to publish it because it could have put him and his family at risk. Evolution, animals evolve over time and only the fittest survive. I need to tell somebody. What are you talking about? Um, nothing, just writing down my feelings. You work way too much. You need to come play with your family. I'm sorry, it's just... I really have to do this, and I don't really feel that good. Okay, I'll go make you some tea. <coughs> Don soon became sick from all the stress he was under, and the death of his nine-year-old daughter, Annie, devastated him. Did you hear about Wallace? He told people about his theory about evolution. What? I don't know why he would do something like this. Devastate his family and challenge God. Don't get any ideas. Uh, I won't. <laughs> What's evolution anyways? Hey Emma, look at this book your husband made. Not a good choice, right? The Origin of Species by Charles Darwin? Charles, come here. Yeah? Can you explain this? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. I had to. Because of you, we're not going to be in the afterlife together. I'm really sorry. After the book was published, many people started to mock Darwin. Society and the church didn't approve. Hey, I heard you are a wild one. Don't worry, because after many generations, Don was respected and became the father of evolution. Hey, thanks for watching! Whoa! Hey! Whoa! Don was a naturalist. Na naturalist. Natur oh, okay. I'll go get you some tea. <laughs> Wait, this is like bothering <laughs> <laughs> Finally looked at his work. Hello, Julia, please don't lick my lamp. Thank you. <gasps> da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da.